rahimahullah ta'ala by saying, أَمَّا هَذَا فَلَيْسَ عِنْدَنَا وَقْتِ وَإِلَّا فَلَيْسَ بِي حَرَامَ عَلَيْنَا بَلْ نَحْنُ مُشْغُولُونَ بِالْكِتَابَ فِي تَأْلِيفِ وتحكيك وتحصيل العلم ونرى أنه أنفع للإسلام والمسلمين ونرى أنه يغيث عداء الإسلام أعظم من المدافع ورشاشات ومن الطائرات وإلا فلماذا يأتون ويسألون عن هذا المعهد وكذلك الإذعاءات وصحف تتكلم عليه عليه لأنه يدرسون الكتاب والسنة والله عز وجل يقول وعدلوا لهم وعد و... لهم ما استطعتم من قوة ومن رباط الخيل ترهبون به عدو الله وعدوكم والنبي صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وسلم يقول المؤمن القوي خير وأحب إلى الله من المؤمن ضعيف وفي كل خير احرس على ما ينفعك The Sheikh responded to the answer or to the question you know is Damaj a place of uh, training military training as uh, many of the people unfortunately have this misconception or claim that it's a place of extremism as the intelligence organizations in America and other places have these false misconceptions about this beautiful blessed village of Khair. So the Sheikh answered Rahimahullah Ta'ala by saying, as for this, then we don't have any time for this. And It is not uh, prohibited for us. This is not something that's prohibited for us. But rather, we are busy with writing and producing books and looking at the, uh, the Hadith sciences and trying to obtain uh, knowledge. And we see that that is more beneficial for Islam and the Muslims. And we see that that angers the enemies of Islam more than uh, defense and uh, weapons and airplanes. And uh, and if and moreover, then why do they ask and they come and ask about this institute? And likewise, uh, the radio stations and the newspapers speak about it. And this is because the Quran and the Sunnah are studied here. And the law of the Almighty says, and prepare for them what you're able to, men strength and war horses, from the war horses, and strike fear into the enemies of Allah and your enemies. And the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wa Alaihi Wasallam said, the strong believer is better and more beloved to Allah than the weak believer. And in both of them is good. So strive to do that which will benefit you. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil, anything that was correct was from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Anything that was incorrect was from myself and the shaitan. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless our shaykh, Shaykh Muqbil bin Hadi al-Wadi, Allah yarhamahu, with jannatul firdaus. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive us and forgive him and bless us all with khair. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad.